Now, this is not the first time someone has tried to take the life of either a sitting American president or a presidential candidate. Democratic presidential candidate Robert F. Kennedy was shot and killed by an assassin on the campaign trail back in 1968. And in 1972, another Democrat running for president, George Wallace, was shot. He survived but was paralyzed and it did end his campaign. And a gunman also opened fire and injured President Ronald Reagan and his press secretary back in 1981. And the incident we all know very well here in North Texas is the assassination of President John F. Kennedy right here in Dallas in 1963.